guys, welcome back. It's Mrs. Peterson, that lady who teaches art, and today I'm going to show you how to create a football field in one point perspective. So we're going to start with the very um, back of the football field, and we're going to put that up near the top of our paper, but not quite all the way to the top. It's going to be a straight line across the back. Then we're going to bring the sides of our football field down at an angle. So we're going to slant this down, 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 and come all the way almost to the bottom of our paper. We're going to do this opposite thing on this side. We're going to slant that all the way down and come almost to the bottom of our paper. And then we're going to do a straight line across connecting those. I think your math teacher would call this a trapezoid. Okay. Um, and the very back of the field is going to be your field goal post. And it's going to look really tiny because it's so far away. Things in perspective look tiny. You're going to put it about in the middle. And you're going to do just a little bit up. Um, straight across. And then if this is just like your high school field, it's probably going to go like that big. If it's a college or a professional field, I think those tend to go taller. So you can make yours as tall as you need it um, based on what you're trying to make. Then down here, we are going to have the field goal post that's closest to us. Um, and this one's going to look a lot bigger. In fact, it um, is going to be much larger than this back one back here. It's going to start behind the line here. And again, you want to find about the middle of your paper. You're going to go straight up. And then you're going to go flat across and straight up. Okay. And then you are going to add your details to your uh, football field. It's easier for me to draw a straight line down. So I'm going to turn my paper. Um, the end of my football field here would have... Um, the team name written right there. So maybe it's, um, you know, something in red or something like that. And then you're going to have the lines that go all the way across your football field. They are going to actually start to look like they got closer together the closer they get to the end. Um, and so this back here where the other side has the name written, it's going to look pretty tiny. So you might want to find like about the halfway point, And then you're going to go closer to the back for your 50-yard line because it looks further away. And then if this is 50, I need a 40, a 30, a 20, a 10. So I need four more lines in here. So I'm going to try to think about how would that spacing go? Like I said, they get closer together at the back. And then you're gonna do the same thing this way. And those might be white lines as you're creating them. And then your football field could be um, green if it's um, turf like that. So same thing here. I'm going to put my lines here. Um, and these are going to be 10 yards. So the first one's going to be about this long because it's closest to the viewer. Two, three, four. Okay. And then you can add your details. If you want this to look like um, it's a stadium full of seats, Behind the field goal up here, you could add some stadium seating, and it would probably come up like this, and then it would kind of curve around like this for where people are going to sit. Okay, so there we have it. There is our football stadium. I can't wait to see what you create. 